Oh, this iron head 4 to 1. As you can see, it's about 51 degrees in the greenhouse. And, oh yeah, it's snowing up the dickens out there. Boy, ain't that snow pretty. It's about 35 outside. And, see, it's 51 in here, and I don't even have a fire built at all. And this, this, this is just, okay, I think I did get a video request, show you around my greenhouse. It is... 8 by 10. It's made of nothing. I, I used uh, scrap steel junk that I had some channels. Uh, post hold them in the ground. Uh, stuck them up. Put some angle iron on them uh, all the way around and I uh, have a chain link there. You can grow uh, uh, cucumbers in the winter time in here. And poured, poured a little cement floor. Uh, didn't have to. Probably shouldn't have but I, I I just didn't want no uh, watering plants in here. You have some muddy mess in here, even if I stoned it. Um, really simple. Built some uh, shells in here, two foot wide. Uh, that is uh, treated plywood. Um, all the way, you know, all the way around three sides of my door. It's just a bunch of scrap metal. I welded it together with that little Lincoln wire welder and these panels. I traded for them. These fiberglass panels, found I got I had some and I traded for them. Didn't cost me a dime. Uh, pretty simple, a nice little greenhouse. And you can see it's 20 degree difference in here than outside. Then I have this nine foot uh, water tray uh, with black plastic. I'm gonna fill it up with water here in a minute. Uh, this thing will hold a thousand seed plants. And that's all I'm gonna need to plant in my garden. Uh, simple little greenhouse. I mean, it wasn't nothing to it. Uh, did it all out of scrap. I got more in this pipe right here in the floor than I do anything. And I think that pipe was about 60 bucks just for the pipe and elbows. And I ain't even built a fire in here, but I'm getting ready to uh, to see how much heat this pipe would generate. Cause see, I'll only have to fire this uh, firebox up just in the month of March on nights that get below 40. That's all. I really want to maintain at least 40 to 50 degrees in here. If it's over 40 at night, I don't have to build a fire at all. So I'm probably looking at only using this firebox maybe two weeks a year. That's it. Now, unless I want to try to grow some stuff in here, you know, up into the late fall up to Christmas. And if I do that, then I'll, I'll need to build a few more fires. Because I, I didn't screw none of these pipes together because I, I plan on taking it out, taking it apart. I don't like to leave it out exposed all year if I'm not using it. Uh, it'll rust and rot pretty fast. So, see, I'm not going to need this thing all the time. If I lived in Alaska, I would definitely want this and a whole bunch of wood to build a fire every night. All right, well, let's plant some seeds here. That's it. <laughs> 